Make your own CalMag fertilizer at home using eggshells and Epsom salt. It's a simple garden hack that can really transform your plants. If your plants are yellowing between the veins, growing weak, or dropping flowers before fruit can even form, stop wasting money on overpriced bottles of fertilizer. The real issue in many gardens isn't a lack of nitrogen or phosphorus. It's a shortage of two overlooked powerhouses, calcium and magnesium. And today, you'll discover how to make your own CalMag fertilizer at home using nothing more than eggshells, vinegar, and Epsom salt. Once you try this, you'll never throw away another eggshell again. Calcium is like the skeleton of your plant. It builds structure, strength, and resilience. Every single cell wall depends on calcium to stay firm. Without it, leaves wilt, roots fail to absorb nutrients, and fruits like tomatoes or peppers develop ugly black spots known as blossom and rot. You could pour bags of fertilizer into your soil, but without calcium, that nutrition just slips through the cracks. Magnesium, on the other hand, is the heart of photosynthesis. It sits at the center of every chlorophyll molecule, the green pigment that allows your plants to capture sunlight and turn it into energy. Without magnesium, leaves fade to pale yellow, while the veins stay stubbornly green. A clear sign the plant is starving for energy. Growth slows to a crawl, fruits lose sweetness, and entire harvests can fail. Together, calcium and magnesium act like a dynamic duo, powering every stage of plant growth from root development to fruit production. That's why commercial growers rely heavily on CalMag supplements. But here's the good news. You can make your own version at home for pennies and it works just as effectively. The main ingredient for calcium is something most households throw away daily. Eggshells. Hard, brittle, and chalky, Eggshells are composed of roughly 95% calcium carbonate. The challenge is that in their raw form, they break down so slowly in soil that plants can't benefit from them right away. Simply tossing eggshells into a garden bed means it may take months before your plants can use the calcium. That's where vinegar comes in. Vinegar contains acetic acid, which reacts with the calcium carbonate in eggshells and transforms it into calcium acetate. Unlike raw shells, calcium acetate is water-soluble, meaning your plants can absorb it almost immediately. In just 24 hours, you can unlock the full calcium power of those shells. For magnesium, the solution is even simpler. Epsom salt, also known as magnesium sulfate, dissolves instantly in water and provides a fast-acting source of magnesium. Unlike slow-release minerals in soil, this form gets into your plants right away, whether through the roots or directly through the leaves. Step 1. Extracting Calcium from Eggshells To get started, you'll need at least 10 clean, dry eggshells. Rinse them thoroughly to remove any egg white or yolk, then let them air dry completely. This prevents mold and ensures the shells are easy to crush. Once dry, grind them down to a fine powder using a blender, grinder, or even a mortar and pestle. Powdered shells expose more surface area, making the extraction faster and more effective. Place the powdered shells in a clean glass jar and pour in one cup of plain white vinegar. Immediately, you'll notice fizzing and bubbling as the acid reacts with the shells. This is the calcium carbonate breaking down into calcium acetate. Allow the reaction to continue until it stops. Then cover the jar loosely and let it sit for 24 hours. Afterward, strain out any leftover shell fragments, and what you're left with is a concentrated calcium extract. Step 2 is preparing the magnesium solution. While your calcium extract sits, you'll want to get the magnesium part ready. So, dissolve 1 teaspoon of Epsom salt into 1 liter of clean water. Give it a good stir until the crystals disappear. And that's it. You now have a magnesium-rich liquid that's all set to be combined with your calcium extract. Step 3 is creating the CalMag solution.
Once your calcium extract is ready, it's time to bring both parts together. Mix 10 milliliters, which is about two teaspoons, of the calcium vinegar extract into one liter of your Epsom salt solution. This creates a balanced homemade CalMag formula that, honestly, rivals anything you'd find on a store shelf. Now here's how to apply homemade CalMag fertilizer. Application makes all the difference, folks. This is a concentrated solution, so you must dilute it properly before use. For foliar sprays, dilute 10 milliliters, or 2 teaspoons, of your CalMag mixture into 1 liter of water. Spray this directly onto the leaves early in the morning or late in the afternoon, when sunlight is gentler. The nutrients will be absorbed almost instantly, and within days you'll notice leaves turning greener and more vibrant. For soil drenching, you'll want to dilute 20 milliliters, or about 4 teaspoons, of the CalMag solution into 1 liter of water. Just pour this mixture directly at the base of your plants, letting it seep right into the root zone. Go ahead and repeat this every two weeks during the growing season. And, you know, for heavy feeders like tomatoes, peppers, cucumbers, and leafy greens, it's a good idea to increase the frequency to once a week during peak growth for the best results. Recognizing the warning signs of deficiency is, honestly, so important. Learning to spot calcium and magnesium deficiencies early is key to saving your harvest. Calcium deficiency usually shows up as blossom and rot on tomatoes, thin pepper skins, or even burnt leaf tips on lettuce. Magnesium deficiency, on the other hand, creates a pretty distinct pattern. Older leaves start to fade to yellow, but their veins stay green. When you see these signs, your plants are basically crying out for help. With homemade CalMag, you can step in quickly, restore balance, and keep your garden thriving. Commercial CalMag fertilizers are effective, but honestly, they come at a steep price, especially if you're maintaining a large garden. Many of those products also contain synthetic stabilizers or unnecessary fillers that really don't do anything for plant health. By making your own at home, you save money, cut waste, and keep your garden organic and chemical-free. The process transforms kitchen scraps into a valuable resource, proving that sustainable gardening doesn't need to be complicated or expensive. Consistency is key. Just like you wouldn't wait until your car engine seizes before adding oil, you shouldn't wait until your plants are collapsing to give them calcium and magnesium. A steady routine keeps growth balanced, fruits healthy, and leaves lush. Always use clean dry shells to prevent contamination, and remember that vinegar is the secret ingredient that unlocks the calcium. Skipping the vinegar step leaves you with shells that may take months to break down. Also, avoid going overboard with Epsom salt. While magnesium is essential, too much can interfere with potassium absorption, creating a whole new set of problems. Stick to the exact measurements in this formula, and your plants will reward you. Homemade CalMag fertilizer is more than a clever gardening hack. It's a game changer. With nothing more than eggshells, vinegar, and Epsom salt, you can craft a potent organic formula that nourishes your crops from the roots to the leaves. This simple method ensures your soil stays balanced, your plants stay strong, and your harvests stay abundant. So the next time you crack an egg, don't toss that shell. Save it, turn it into liquid gold for your garden, and watch your plants thrive. If you found this video helpful, hit that subscribe button, share it with other growers, and stay tuned to Soil and Crops Central for more proven methods to grow stronger, healthier plants. Your garden will thank you, and so will anyone who gets to taste the difference in your harvest.